This was just loose. Same thing with the neck bearing. Greasy and oily and in a real terrible state. I'm gonna have to do some cleaning. Break nothing. Oh, more than it's already broken. Just have to hold it. Yeah. Is it working? Oh, it is almost working. Just have a little bend. We're going to need to address, but it coming back in line the space here even and up all right let's go a little more and yeah, that seems a lot better these adjustments here are way out of work though the, the adjustment for the high gear is all the way in and the adjustment for the low gear is all the way out all right let's try it as is and see how it working Progress, almost success and victory. All right, let me keep at it a little bit. I need to do a few more adjustments on it. Niceness, we guess we can. Now let the ratch work pretty well. Still see a nice slight bend on the arms on them, but the pulley is in the correct position. Alright, what's next? Next, we're gonna check the front derailleur, I guess. Give the bike a overall clean down and take it for a little ride. See if we find any more problems with it. So far, so good, Tommy Orchin. Niceness. After all this, you had to make a ride with me, Virgin. That's right, because it ain't clean till it's OCD clean. Hey, She do have a lemon play with she. Anyway, alright guys. It bike clean, it dry, it shifted nice, things tight, nothing rattled and loose anymore. The only thing left to do now is apply a little lubrication. I'll give you a little cut how we do that. 
There we go. All right, so here's what we do. We take a syringe with a WD-40 straw. And then we use some shock oil, which is a very light, it's a little bit heavier than machine oil. But we syringe up a little bit. There we go. And then, hold on, get all in position. Right. We use the syringe with the WD-40 straw to lubricate each of these rollers. So we go around the entire chain and we oil all of these rollers. I could use an oil can or something for this job, but this is my preference, this is what I like to use. When you finish with the chain, we move on to the derailleur and each of these joints, each moving part, we're going to give it a little bit of oil. Same thing with the front here, the front derailleur. And then, then we run through the gears, make sure everything's shifting properly and then and we can go for a test ride. Yeah. Alright guys, that's right time. Now if I'm being totally, absolutely honest, I have never in my life ridden a small tire drop handle bicycle. So I'm a little bit, a little bit trepidatious to say the least. Let me see how this goes, let me see how it feels. You know what? That's not bad at all. <laughs> it's a different experience to the mountain bike altogether. For the road, it's nice. I wouldn't take it off road. Not to the kind of places I just go with my bike. But for on the road, you will appreciate this beast. Anything paved, hard packed. Niceness. Alright, now to call Tommy and let me know you bike ready. We could make a ride. 